welcome to today's Tuesday tip. Are you ready for some more tips on MORs? Sure you are. Let's get started. First, the life or the medical alert device is not counted as a medical expense. I was on property and they used the help. I've fallen and I can't get up. Device is a medical expense, but it's not. Second is over and under housing. If you have residents that have lived on your property for 15 years, they may have had a three or four bedroom unit. Well, they've downsized. The kids have gotten older, they've moved on, and mom's still stuck in a four or five bedroom unit. But guess what? HUD's still paying the subsidy for a four or five bedroom unit. So therefore, you need to downsize mom to a smaller unit. If she's alone, a one bedroom. If you don't have any one bedroom units, then go ahead, get permission from your local HUD office to relocate her to a two bedroom unit. Next, follow the handbook for third party verifications of income. As you know, it's EIV first, the old fashioned third party verification, the review of documents, or self certifications. I've seen owners and agents using food stamp reports, checking accounts, and other information to verify the income. But no, use those four steps. If you're verifying assets, then you just use the third party verification. You use the review of documents and a self-certification. And it is okay to use a self-certification. Next. Change in security deposits. If you have to change the security deposit for any other reason or any reason at all, you didn't get the TTP correctly, you need to draw a line through the amount, write in the correct amount, and each party has to initial it. I'm seeing it in the file folders where only management or the owner agent initials the lease, but both parties have to initial the change. So. I want to thank you for tuning in today. I want to tell you to tune again next week for more MOR tips. Hope you're enjoying this series. Thanks. Did you like this video? Hit the like button below. Do you wanna see more content just like this? Be sure to subscribe to all our social media platforms. And if you know someone who could really use this information, be sure to share it.